Hey guys, Darcy here and welcome to a tutorial on how to get the new YouTube homepage design. Now, as you can see right here on the YouTube homepage, and uh, this is the current design, and YouTube is going to be switching things up again and, you know, redesigning their website like they always do. Um, so if you want to, like, test it out and have a look what this is going to look like, you can actually do that if you use Google Chrome or Firefox. So if you're using Google Chrome, what you need to do is you need to press Control shift j and let me just click on the window, Control shift j this will bring up the developer console. If you're using uh, Firefox, you need to press Control shift k um, So there'll be some instructions in the description just to make sure that you guys are clear on what to do. Uh, also in the description, there's a code that you need to copy. The code looks like this, document.cookie, blah, 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 and uh, that's in quotation marks in the description. So copy and paste that and go onto the YouTube homepage and paste that into your developer's console, then press enter. As you can see, the YouTube page is gonna reload and you've got this new white design. So this is what it looks like. As said, it's currently like in a beta stage, so it's a little bit buggy. Um, so we're just gonna go over some of the features. So as you can see, um, the layout here, the channel feed has changed. Uh, you can see uploads or, you know, um, people will upload in light and you have to change from highlights to view like you did on the other one. Uh, otherwise, it's only gonna show you stuff from bigger YouTubers or um, YouTubers with a lot of likes and comments and stuff like that. So make sure you hit everything if you're gonna keep this and then click uploads only if you wanna only see uploads. That way you're gonna get everything from everyone, hopefully, if YouTube has fixed their um, publishing system. Uh, as you can see, you can click on your favorite YouTubers pages here. Uh, what that's going to do is that's going to open up a preview of their channel on the home page. Uh, so you know, you can see all their activity um, here if you scroll down or you can just see that upload so uh, that's really good also this little box here you can like take type in a name so for example you just type in a name that you know is going to bring up your youtubers and uh, you can just search from there so I actually really like that feature that's really good for people who know they want to watch a video from someone and so they can type it on their homepage straight away um, down here you can add channels um, so I'm pretty sure this is the same as you know subscribing to people uh, but as you can see, it's it's not being redesigned yet. I'm sure they're going to go to the white design that they're kind of rolling out right now. Um, down in the manage box, it shows you, you know the list and the people in um, order of the, what they're going to be in on your page, and you can unsubscribe to people. You can go to you know click to show the uploads only in the activity feed, that sort of thing. You can um, get email notifications. Uh, this is really buggy as you can see everything seems really like all over the place and they haven't quite got the HTML and the CSS sorted on this page yet But uh, it's kind of interesting. It shows everyone in order like it did on the old one, but in a more, you know um, Useful way. What does this do? I put it down on this one I'm just trying to work it out as you can. Oh, yeah, this is um, so you can see your own stuff So like on the other one if you click on your name, you can see your channel. You can see your videos uh, you watch later your history and stuff like that. Um, exactly the same as you can see your friends videos here as well. Um, now I'm going to teach you how to get rid of this because I'm sure a lot of you are going to go on it and you're going to hate it and you're going to want to get rid of it. So if you're on Google Chrome you need to go into your settings. Same as um, Firefox, I'm just using Chrome right now. So navigate to you know your settings and for Google Chrome you need to go show advanced settings. Um, you need to come down to content settings and privacy and you need to go to your cookies and site data. Um, Firefox, you're gonna have to work that out. I'm sorry, I don't use Firefox at all. Uh, but you know, you get to your cookies, search for the YouTube cookies here, and uh, that's gonna bring it up, and go to the one that has the most cookies, so this one has 20. Um, come over to Visitor Info 1 Live, click on it, and remove it. And uh, now when you go onto your YouTube homepage again, let me just refresh, it's going to bring up your old layout. So uh, that might work for people who have been activated this design already and they don't like it. So uh, try that, I'm not sure if it works. If it does, leave a comment in the uh, comment section and then obviously people thumbs up that comment so people can see. And if it doesn't work, do the same thing. Uh, so yeah, that's the new YouTube homepage uh, design. Obviously, over the next couple months or whatever, YouTube's gonna start let rolling that out. So get used to it uh, because you're gonna, you're gonna hate it probably when it comes out. Anyways, I've been Dalsy. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you did, hit that thumbs up button, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.